given the functional equation f of x minus y is equal to f of x times f of y minus f of a minus x times f of a plus y. Let's call this equation 1. Now setting x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 0 in this equation, we get on the left hand side f of 0 and on the right hand side we get f of 0 whole square minus f of a whole square. Now we are given that f of 0 is equal to 1 and therefore this equation becomes 1 is equal to 1 minus f of a whole square. The 1 cancels out and therefore we are left with f of a whole square is equal to 0 which implies that f of a is equal to 0. Now we go back to equation 1 and set x is equal to a and y is equal to x minus a. Therefore the left hand side becomes f of a minus x minus a and on the right hand side the first term is f of a times f of x minus a and the second term on the right hand side is f of a minus a or f of 0 times f of a plus x minus a. After some simplification this is as in f of 2a minus x is equal to 0 minus f of x because f of a has been determined earlier to be equal to 0 and therefore f of 2a minus x is equal to minus fx which is the required result.